Junior Senior. G'day YouTubers, it's Senior here from Junior Senior Gaming and today we're doing a mod review for Euro Truck Simulator 2 which is the... Uh, it's the Freightliner Daimler inspiration I think it is. So anyway, there's a, I saw that there was a couple of these at the same time so we might have a look at both of these this week. So, sorry I got the hiccups. Uh, first of all, we're having a look at the cabin. Now, there's only one cabin. It says Globetrotter XL, which I think they used the base model from the uh, the Volvo, uh, which they've not really changed any of these little decals anyway. So, let's go off to the chassis. And you can see the chassis here is a 6x4, the only option. Now, for the engines, there is a few here to uh, have a look at. Uh, we've got the uh, the D1 D13 C380 E5, uh, 380 horsepower. The Cummins ISX15, um, and that's it. That's all we've got. Okay. All right. Well, we'll just start with that one there, and then we'll have a look at the Cummins. Now, uh, moving on to transmission, we have the iShift ATO 3512D. Uh, 12 speed, there's 12 speed C, 12 speed D with retarder, and there's the Eaton Fuller RTLO 22918B AS. And there, in, there down the bottom is the iShift 12 speed with retarder. Uh, you know me, guys, I like the Eaton Fuller. Um, I think that this truck really deserves to be in ATS rather than ETS because, you know, it is like an American truck, but, uh, uh, like a prototype truck this one is so now off to the interior and I'm sorry to say guys but this absolutely looks disgusting to me it looks like somebody's throwing up and then somebody's mashed it up with some paper towel and then throwing up again and then slapped it on the dash and called it a dash uh, I don't like it at all I think it's disgusting um, that's as far as I can turn around. I can't turn around anymore at the moment. So we'll try again when we get to the accessories for the interior. Now let's have a look at the paint job. Paint jobs. Uh, there's the actual skin so you can. It does come with a skin so you can do your own template there. I wonder if you can actually change anything here. No, won't let you. Uh, that's fine. Then we've got the paint job which is just black. Then there is the, it is Chili Burnt Orange Metallic. That is a very interesting color, that one. Uh, Agate, Deep Ocean, there's Deep Ocean again. There's Perfect White, Scorpio Red, Scorpio Red again. Snow White, doesn't look quite Snow White, but anyway. Um, Mineral Gray, Passion Red, Graphite, uh, Marinello Red, uh, OptiFuel Gray which looks like oh no it's snow white's a bit lighter uh there's Al alsace green and cobalt blue white cloud acacia green acacia green again a couple of these are uh, copied over clear white celestial blue there's emerald green lion blue Mil milano red olive green polar white velocity red crystal white uh, not crystal meth, but crystal white. Uh, night blue, rose red, Prague yellow, Ultima blue, deep basalt, Gambol grey. Um, uh, what's that? Istanbul blue, sunny yellow, amber yellow, bronze autumn, mystery blue, Carrara ivory, autumn orange, autumn orange again. Black Star, Cocoa Brown, Graphite Grey, Graph uh, Shadow Grey. I'm pretty sure we're doubling up on these damn colours here. For crying out loud. So we're going to skip them. Custom Colour. Uh, there we go. Any other custom colours. So that works fine. You have Silver White. You have Silver Grey. You have the Amber Glory. Citroen. The Grand Citroen Metallic. Which those two don't look too bad custom metallic color which only gives you two choices which is interesting go to a blue there and it's very strange but there's only two colors the the pearly sort of color is set 
Oh, sorry. That's because I did that. There we go. <laughs> oh, senior, you're so silly sometimes. Silly senior. And there's the proper custom metallic there with the three colors. As you can see, there's one, there's white there. There's the second one. And there is the third one, clear as day on this truck. Looks really good, actually. Right, now, then we have some other metallic colors. Now, what we're looking for here is just like we can see here, the little dots on the roof, uh, which they're working fine. See, look, all the... Um, there we go. There's heaps of them to choose from, which is great because a lot of the time you see on the mods, they really do suck and they don't work properly. So uh, now they seem to be working quite well, which is good. So I'm going to go to that color there, the uh, Amber Glory. I think that looks really good on this truck. And let's have a look at the accessories. So uh, first of all, let's fix up this grill. It looks shocking with the grill, without, without the grill. Right, so having a look at that, that's the first one. Great original, original green. There's that one there, just all chrome. And there is that one, it's weird. It is, is it uh, Colmia? I don't know. Then it has some little dicky things, some what's his name, type A, type B, that thingy, that duvalaki. It's got blue duvalaki, red duvalaki, green duvalaki, and an alien. Well, it doesn't look like it's a lumen new alien. Let's leave that one on there. Looks interesting. All right, uh, you can go and put some uh, lights on. Uh, bull bar, a big, a big monobrow bull bar which covers the lights up. There's a big mouth bull bar. Smiley face, smiley face again. Uh, that just looks weird. That looks just not right. And then there's that one there, which probably out of all of them would suit. But I'm not going to have that. We're still going to check it though. Oh yeah, you can put lights on. Yep. All right, I'm just going to take that one off because I really like the truck the way it is like that. So now uh, these all these pictures have got stupid pictures that don't match. So uh, we can chuck in some little lights down here, as you can see, and we turn the lights on. They shine beautifully. Well, uh, there we go. You can see them there properly. That's nice. Very nice. Oh, yes. Yes. Ooh. Ah. Eee. Mmm. Ah. I like that one. There we go. It match. It sort of matches that there. And then we can go up to here and we can put eyelids on. So you want to put eyelids on. There you go. Chrome ones or just normal ones. I'm going to put normal painted ones on there. And then on the side there we have... It is bumper guides. I don't think this really should have bumper guides on there I don't like the look of the bumper guides but you can put them on both sides there now on there you can get a wind deflector and it's got the uh, infinity emblem on there so um, I think uh, what I'll do is I'll put that one on there no actually that one there the chrome matches now up to the windscreen we have again that logo has not been changed uh, tinted windows look at how tinted those windows can get that is just awesome and then blue tint red tint green purple see there's all sorts of amber I think oh that was amber was it yeah and there we are that is I don't know what Laranja is. I have no idea. Uh, then we've got like these other ones there. So there we go. Uh, I'm going to choose the the ready sort of color. I think that looks great on there. Now, uh, one thing you will notice is that the mirrors are a bit messed up at the moment. So I'm not sure what the go is with that, but they are completely stuffed if you have a look at them. Um, now. I have noticed that you can actually fix those like that there. So that fixes the problem. I don't know why that is there, but if we take that off, they're completely stuffed. 
So anyway, put the mirrors on. And then we have there, that's the main mirrors. There's only one option there for that. Up the top here, you can have your anchor points for your lights, horns, etc, etc. See, there's a horn there. Yeah, but it sort of goes into the paintwork there, into the body. So that's no good. And you can also put lights on there if you want, as you see. But uh, there are some other options. You've got the Mirage, you've got the Sting, you've got the Viking, and the Dragonfly. Oh, look, let's go back to that one there. We'll throw a few headlights on there. Make them square. No, not square. Let's, let's, yeah, put those ones on. This may spoil it, these lights, but I like headlights. I really do. Um, and then we'll put some horns on there. They're inside the truck, which is interesting. Hmm. Can you see them on the inside? No, you can't. Okay, well, maybe that, uh, that might work. We'll just leave them on the inside and deafen ourselves while we're driving along. Uh, now down to up to sorry up to there we go up to uh, beacon light you can put a beacon light on there we'll put the space one on there it looks pretty cool uh, down there is the uh, that is the rear windows you can tint them just like you could the front ones and is that the matching color I think that is yeah that looks like it's the matching color yeah, my eyes aren't that good with colors, guys. You know that. Yeah, it is. That is. Okay. So that that was that. Now, in there, we can put a laptop and navigation. Laptop and navigation. Over there, we can put the air hose. A rack for the air hose. There's that one there and that one there. Look, I'm going to chuck that on there. And you can't put anything in those little slots there, which is a shame. Then here, we have... The exhaust, as you can see, there's two singles, there's a short, there's taller ones, and it actually says Dick on there, so uh, Abga Winkle, um, High Pipes Abga Winkle Dick, so if you want to have an Abga Winkle Dick, then there you go, you can have two Abga Winkle Dicks, and then yeah. Um, high pipes, Gerard, Gerard, and then double high pipes. Hmm. I think I'm going to have the, um, the, uh, Abgawinkle Dick pipes. I think they look a lot better. Now, uh, spinning around, pretty sure that was it. Yes, it is. There's the Abgawinkle Dick. Now, um, over to the tyres. Now, there is a few tyres that you can choose from here. There is the uh, 31570 Trailmaster. There's the Pirelli, which looks strange to me, but anyway. Uh, then there's the Speedline Goodyear, which looks like Formula One tyres. Still looks very strange. Uh, and then there's those ones there, the Elemental. Um... Yeah, I'm just going to leave it on those ones there. That looks just weird, those other tyres. Now, the rims, you can just have any of the standard rims that you like. Now, uh, let's see which one, which one, which one. Um, I don't know. There is... Oh, look. Oh, no, there we are. There's some extra ones. Maybe I missed them before. Oh, dear. Uh, red, let's go those ones there. That looks awesome. They look awesome. Uh, nuts, paint your nuts, people. Chrome, no. Oh, no, 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 no. Standard. Uh, no, they're poking through. That's no good. What about those? Oh, they're poked through too. Uh, just standard will have to do because otherwise they're poking through and they look stupid. Oh, look at that. That looks great. You can change the colors in there, all different colors. Look at that. 
Oh, it looks so nice. And then we've got these other ones here. So, still heaps to go. You can paint that one if you want. And these are the, a lot of the standard ones here. Even the Raven fits in there nicely. But, I think... Is your vanilla ver... Uh, vermella? Vermella. I think that one there looks good. And I wonder what covers they have in here. Let's see. Just the standard covers it looks like. If you want to put a cover on there, that's what it's going to look like. So, it won't look as nice with those covers on. So, let's just completely remove them altogether. That looks really nice, doesn't it? Off to the rims on the back. And let's check it out. The tyres. Uh, again, you can have... Pirelli, Michelin, try and zoom in there if I can and I'll spin it around so we can see it a bit better. There we go. Um, there we go, standard tyres, Michelin, Goodyear, and there's Pirelli, and there's the uh, Elemental. So I'm just going to go the standard ones on this. Now, all the standard ones which we've seen before we know and then there's dark silver right hang on this looks a little bit different to what when I first tried this out there was covers on the wheels so I wonder if there's something that I've done wrong there was covers on the wheels before hmm Okay, well, let's go and put standard chrome on anyway. And we'll leave the... We'll put that on there. Put the center as... You can put scan your center if you want. Um, just put that one there. That looks very good. And there we go. That's weird. I don't know what's happened there because... When I first looked at this, it was had a covers on the wheels. So, I wonder what's happened to them. Uh, let's see. Now, there we go. There's those covers. That looks really nice. But it's a shame that the actual hub centers here, you know, they don't have like the red color you know that they have on the front there there's the auxil auxilia 2 auxilia 1 I suppose you could paint it couldn't you I'm, I'm gonna put that one on there I think that looks so much better right well um, yeah, so I'm not sure what happened with the wheels. There was a cover that I looked at before, when I looked at this before. It had a cover over the wheels, but it's not there now, so I'm not sure. Maybe I've missed something. Hmm. Um, might be an option that I've selected and not selected this time that I did differently. But anyway, there's the mirror on the side there, which you can take off if you want. Let's have a look at the inside now. Oh. Looks terrible. Uh, there's the mirrors. There's a GPS there if we want to chuck a GPS in. Then you can go and there's the the um, the wind deflector. If you have the accessories pack, you can go and put these little nice accessories on. And we'll put World of Trucks on there. A curtain. You can go and put an ugly ass curtain in there. And not all of them are in there but we're going to remove that because ugly as and there we go not all of them are in here either interesting uh, now let's put the yeah let's put the hula girl I like the hula girl oh my goodness her legs are chopped off oh dear let's try it again has her legs chopped off oh, oh my goodness that's horrible. Her legs are all right there. Oh, no. Somebody amputated her legs. That's terrible. I, I'm just shocked. Now, uh, that is for the outside. 
Now there we can you can put any of these bags on there, whatever. Let's just put that overnight bag. I always put that there. And the esky, I like the esky. And that's the mirror. There's there's a mirror on the side there, which you can see and is working properly. But that's it. Let's confirm this. <coughs> wow. Futuristic. Do a trade in on the last mod. And there we go. Let's have a look. See how long it takes to load. Well, that wasn't long at all. So it all looks very nice from what I can see here. No big gaping holes or anything that I can see. I like those windows. I think they really do match the truck. Some people would say it's a little bit too much red, but it doesn't matter. <coughs> oh. Bit of a cough. It's a shame there wasn't the rims weren't the same as the, on, on the front as they were on the back. That's a shame as well. Now let's get in starter up. There we go. Now let's turn the lights on. Very nice. There's the high beams. And there's the horn. Standard horn. And we got indicators here. Yep, indicators there. Yep. Yep, they're all working. Right. Looks very nice, this. I don't mind it at all. Right, uh, indicators, indicators, yep, yep. Now, uh, I, let's push I. And it doesn't crash, good. Very good, okay. Let's see if we can go and check out the... Oh, that's different, isn't it? Wow, that's a different engine, that is. Okay, oh, hang on. Let me get that closer. Okay, let's get out and check out this engine. There we go. Now, I'll just go in and we'll get that other engine. Check that out. And there we are, the Cummins. Alright, there was a little gap there, if you listen. Hear that? There's that gap there. Let's see if we can get that gap. There it is, right there. Yeah, sounds nice, but there's a gap in the audio, so it doesn't sound as nice as what the other engine does. I like that other engine a lot better. Let's go see how a, uh, what do you got? 600, 690. There we go. Let's go confirm that. Right. Let's go. Let's go take it for a drive. I really, really do hate the interior for this. Look at that map on the uh, on the dash there. That is that's huge. Don't need uh, don't need that one. Wow. This. This is interesting. It's it's very interesting, this truck. It's not what I expected at all. Get in the damn gear. 
Um, yeah, it, it's um, definitely different. I just need to get wait for this light here so I can give it a bit more of a test because uh, it just feels the steering feels fine. It's the like look at how fast I'm going through the gears here. Oh damn it, that's right. Damn European transmission. And what's that? That's 30, 60 kilometers. Oh, I didn't hear the actual, um, didn't hear the banana break. No, no banana break, so can't hear that. So, uh, yeah, well, maybe this one doesn't have one. I thought a truck like this, a concept truck like this, might have more of an electric engine or sort of a futuristic sound, but uh, maybe they're not quite there yet. But still, it's not bad. It's not a bad truck to drive. The sounds aren't too bad, and um, really, it's there's nothing really that I can pick on this to say that it's you know bad. But it's just gonna, it just might take a few people a bit of getting used to. That's all. So um, yeah, but guys, if you would like to see this in the weekly drive, then you know what to do. In the description below, say yes, I would like to see this in the weekly drive. And if you don't want to see this in the weekly drive, then also in the comments tell me no, I would not like to see this in the weekly drive. And also give it a score out of 10 as well. Uh, let everyone know that, you know, it's worth, say, I don't know, whatever, whatever you want. You know, you, you, you put it in there. Just give it a score out of 10 uh, to let everyone know. Now, uh, if this is the first time you've seen Junior Senior Gaming, then make sure you head on over to the Junior Senior Gaming channel and check us out. We have a ton of uh, Euro Truck Simulator 2 videos, a ton of American Truck Simulator videos, uh, spin tires, we've got farming sim, we've got heaps and heaps of vehicle simulation games, guys, so make sure you head on over there and check it out. But that is pretty much it for me today, guys. Look, thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to keep the shiny side up and the greasy side down. And I'm 1010 on the side. And remember, game on! Thanks for watching, YouTubers. If you'd like to see more videos, then click on the links beside. Just over here, we're taking a look at this week's second place winner for the weekly drive, the Peterbilt 379 Dump Truck. Just down there, we're taking a look at the Western Star 4864 for American Truck Simulator. If you'd like to visit our website or you'd like to subscribe, then click on the links below. Thanks again for watching, YouTubers, and remember, game on!